Okay. Hey, uh, over the last 12 hours, we've had some rain, rain that we desperately needed. You know, depending where we're at in Omaha yesterday, may have had a quick downpour, heard some thunder or not much at all. But you can see over the last 12 hours from Tecamen, Norfolk, some pockets of uh, decent rainfall, Columbus to Lincoln, Lincoln Airport overnight picked up close to a quarter of an inch of rain, but all the showers overnight now moving well off to the south of the metro. Some heavier rain down in Fall City, maybe some rumbles of thunder also toward Mound City, the Maryville area, so that will continue to push south here as we get closer to sunrise. Some lingering just sprinkles that have drifted through Bellevue, Plattsmith, and are moving out. So drying out here early this morning. That's a look over Omaha currently. Clouds are starting to break up as well. Fairly comfortable start, low 60s currently, 62 at Epley Airfield, dew points in the 50s and not much of a breeze at the moment. Where the clouds have cleared out a little bit more, temperatures dropping down to 55 now in Norfolk, 57, Columbus still holding on to 64, Lincoln, Beatrice 65 and Falls City. This is some good news, continued improvement in air quality. Just a sliver of our viewing area out west of Columbus towards Schramsburg and York still in that unhealthy for sensitive groups, but everybody else in the moderate category and we should see continued improvement throughout the day as that smoke thins out. So we've got quite the Friday in store as the showers move out. Clouds will fall out quickly this morning by lunchtime. Beautiful day to enjoy the lunch hour outside mid 70s light winds, tons of sunshine. Likely topping out low to mid 80s across most of the viewing area. More likely mid 80s, Lincoln, Beatrice, Norfolk, lower 80s, Carroll, Atlantic, Harlan, Shenandoah. This evening, maybe heading out uh, for dinner starting off the weekend. Great patio night. High school football couldn't ask for much better weather as we'll continue to see temperatures sliding in the 70s overnight. Now, a little cool to start off Saturday will likely be in the 50s. Cold front still well off to our north. I think we get through most of the day dry. We'll still warm up into the low to mid 80s again. But as that front gets closer, I think we have a little better chance to see some scattered shower and storm activity close to the metro, especially as we get closer to sunset and thereafter as this front drops south. So storm chances going up, especially into Saturday night, and we still could have some showers and storms around the area on Sunday, but you see temperatures dropping off into the 70s, still lingering showers Sunday night into the first half of Monday and really fall like next week. All those highs low to mid 70s and we could be on a top 10 day watch for a couple of those days next week.